good morning children welcome to english class in last class we have completed first lesson fully as i know we have completed uh, studio and companion first lesson today we are starting second lesson children everyone open your studio page 15 okay in page 15 the second lesson title is there children our second lesson title is tom sawyer tom t o m tom sawyer s a w y e r sawyer okay tom sawyer and let's have the pep activity children first in 2.1 See, Sahil and Shushan have a lot of home fun to complete. Look at the images to know what they are thinking. Okay, here two boys are there, Sahil and Shushan. Okay, these both are having so much of homework. Okay, now let's see what they are doing. First, Sahil. Sahil is thinking like this. I have so much home fun to do. He is doing his work. And he is thinking that I think that all our work will be done in chess. Go all the way. And put that. Next, Sushant is thinking like this. I am so lucky. I have a brother who does my home fun for me. Okay, what Sushant is doing? Sushant is assigning his work to his brother, and he is simply enjoying the music, and he is making his brother to do his work. Now, see, who do you think is right? Sahil or Sushant, tick the box to show your response. Okay, Sahil is correct or Sushant is correct, children? Yes, Sahil is correct. Is it no? Yes. Why? Give one reason. They are asking why Sahil is correct because Sahil is doing his work by his own. Sahil is doing homework by his. Or he is not assigning that to anyone. That means one reason in below lines how you have to write is in page fifteen because Sahil doing homework by his own. Okay, once again I am reading children write like this because Sahil doing homework by his own. Okay. Like this, write down, children, and next turn the page. Page sixteen. See, let us now read a story about another boy like Sushan. Okay, let here also we are having one story, children, the about a boy who is like Sushan only. What Sushan did? Sushan, he is not doing his work, but he is giving his work to. Others, okay, like that. Another boy is also there in our story. Let's learn about that boy. Okay, we already know the boy name. What is the boy name? Tom Sawyer. Okay, his name itself we have. They have given as title. Tom Sawyer is a boy. Children. For about that boy, we are learn going to learn in this story. See, Tom. There was no answer. Tom was nowhere to be seen. Okay, Tom. Someone is calling Tom. Tom, but no one is responding and no answer anywhere. Okay, and Tom is also not there. Okay, Tom is nowhere and Tom was. Uh, there is no answer for this. Tom, Tom. Someone is calling Tom. Who is calling? See, Aunt Polly. Aunt Polly is there. Another character. Aunt Polly. Looking for her nephew. What do you mean by nephew, children? A son of one's brother or sister. That means okay, brother son kani, ah sister son kani unte. Bhalani nephew under him. Okay, that means here Aunt Polly is having nephew. Who is that nephew? Tom Sawyer. Aunt Polly nephew is Tom. Sawyer, and he was a young boy of about ten years of age. Okay, Tom Sawyer is young boy, and how many years he is? Yes, ten years old. This Tom Sawyer is ten years old boy, and this Aunt Polly is ah uh, this Tom's auntie. Okay, Tom's auntie. Who is she? Aunt Polly. And Aunt Polly nephew is Tom. Okay, now Aunt Polly was searching 
for tom tom is not there okay he is not responding he is not there and aunt polly was searching okay why aunt polly is searching tom where did this tom went we will see in our next class children tom ekkadiki velladu and tom kosam aunt polly enduku vetukutunnaru okay what happened after this we will see in our next class i am not giving any homework children do prepare well for your exam and write well in the afternoon session okay children thank you have a nice day